First at five tonight, in his last act in office, former Governor Doug Ducey started removing these shipping containers at the border he began placing months ago. Yeah, he tried to secure the border, and this was one of the ways he was going to do it. The project was supposed to cost taxpayers about $120 million to install. 3,000 containers were to be placed at the border wall gaps to uh, really protect that side of the border, but no more. Fox 10's Marissa Sarbach joins us live with the latest. Marissa. John Christina, when the Department of Justice was suing Governor Doug Ducey, former Governor Doug Ducey now, and the state of Arizona, he was given until this Wednesday to remove all of those shipping containers. Now it's estimated that the removal project will cost about $75 million. Former Governor Doug Ducey passing the torch to Governor Katie Hobbs, and with it, the responsibility of protecting Arizona's southern border. In his final hours in office, removal of the shipping containers in the border wall gaps began in Yuma County. The federal government sued Ducey and the state of Arizona back on December 14th, demanding deconstruction of the container wall. Ducey responded in a letter saying the shipping containers were always meant to be a temporary border security solution due to inaction by the federal government. Yuma's mayor, Douglas Nichols, had told Fox 10 back in September the containers were working, not to stop people from crossing, but to divert them to the ports. The shipping containers are, are working. They're closing the gaps. They've, they've closed off the most um, active areas. But chairman of the Yuma County Board of Supervisors, Tony Reyes, who issued a state of emergency in Yuma a few weeks ago for the migration surge, calls the containers nothing but a political stunt. If you're going to, to talk about the effectiveness of the, uh, of the containers, they, all, they obviously didn't work. There's more people crossing. There was more people crossing after those containers than before. Which they were just crossing at a different location. The office of Arizona's 24th governor has just issued a statement on the matter. Quote, Governor Hobbs had said from the start that these shipping containers are an expensive political stunt that did nothing to address the real issues at the border. And it is expected to take at least a week to remove all of those shipping containers along our southern border. Live outside the state capitol, Marissa Sarbach for Fox 10 News.